Okay, uh, this will be my first drone video that I have on here. Uh, I took this video quite a while ago and I had it saved. And uh, this was actually my first flight. And I was just flying over the yard here. You can see the one tractor. There I'm just flying over the hay stack. As you can see the hay stack is right full at this time or pretty much full we haven't taken any from it uh, actually I flew it pretty good there for the first time a little bit too fast but I uh, flew, flew out the back kinda did a little circle come around to where the cows are there's a few cows there right now at that time which was, I, I think it was before Christmas uh, that is the cattle yard that I had. actually the previous video was taken in. As you can see, there's no cattle there right now because they are way on the other field there to the top of the screen. And, uh, the heifers are, are in the corral there. We just brought them. So this was just after Christmas. Yeah, that's right. Um, Sean is in the excavator. And my brother Lori is right there in the corral. We were trying to pull those broken posts out where we ended up burning them. And he's watching us fly it right now. So Sean was getting the hole in position. And uh, you can probably see me there looking down at this green flying it. So yeah I uh, took her around for a loop there and then I thought well I'm going to try and put it up to uh, about 100, 120 feet or so, get a shot to the south. Uh, that's our, that is our home, the rest of the home quarter field, which was barley this year, or this last year. Uh, that's my brother's place in the background, his acreage. You see the highway. And I kind of just uh, hovered there. I think I, I think I went up to about 120 feet. Uh, that was that was my first flight. So I'm gonna load the second one on here, which I took the other day. Okay, so this is the video I took just the other day, which was uh, February 16th, and uh, yeah, um. Sean and Lori were just at the cattle checking around and I decided it was a nice day to fly the drone so I had to fly her over the haystack to get a look at how much we've used so far since uh, um, the 1st of January I would have believed until now how much is gone there and you can tell the, there's a good chunk taken out of it from where the, the, the three high stack straw bales are uh, you can tell where the kind. You can kind of tell. Yeah, there's a one bale that tipped over there. That's where the stack, the haystack was. So you can tell how much is gone from there. And I we had around two thousand rolls. We're down to just a little over a thousand now. Uh, yeah. So that showed how much hay is gone now. And I'm flying kind of high, and I just wanted to do kind of a circle and but I wanted to fly kind of farther out from where the cattle were and you can start you could you can see that they're starting to get spooked now they start running you can see them in the corner and yeah then the, kind of got the whole herd going there yeah I heard uh, I heard the guys yelling so I turned it around and hauled ass back to uh towards the yard to get out of there when I turned my head that way they were uh they were all running past the gate so I figured uh yeah that that'll be no more flying the drone by the cows so I saw Iowa Dairy Boys using hit yeah there's a good shot they all they're just like ants yeah they all ran to the 
to the other end of the cattle yard, so and uh, I had to come back there to land because I'm not 100% sure if you can land anywhere. Well, I think you can uh, land when you tell it to go to back to home to land. I'm not 100% sure if you can go land somewhere else instead of that. But I always land it automatically. I never have landed it myself. So yeah, so I just did a little quick flight there and put her down. And yeah, that will be uh, that was it for that. So. Uh, yeah, I won't, uh, I won't be having, uh, too many, uh, more videos like that. Um, uh, but I'll be using the drone more for, uh, summer, like more in the springtime, summertime when the tractor's in the field and stuff like that, so hope to be doing more of that. But you never know. I'll pull it out some of these days. Not around the cattle. If I'm doing something to take more good. Well, uh, that was all for now, so thanks for watching. Make sure you comment, rate, and subscribe.